Hi everyone, welcome to Watch It Played. My name is Rodney Smith, and in this video, I want to tell you about a rule for Fog of Love that we missed in our tutorial video, but it might come up in your games. So let's go quickly to the table, and I'll explain how it works. When creating your character, you'll be drawing five traits and picking three to keep. And if you decide to keep two traits that have the same aspect, that is, they both relate to the same personality dimension and are both pointed in the same direction, then at the end of the game, you pick either one of them and the requirements to fulfill that one are actually doubled. So at the end of the game, if I had these traits, I might say that this one is doubled and therefore I'd actually need a net of at least six of my tokens in the upward personality dimension of the blue arrow. In the very rare case that all three of your traits show the matching aspects, the requirements are tripled for the third similar trait goal. If you watched our full playthrough for Fog of Love, then you might have noticed that the Mark character claimed to have completed two matching trait goals, but that wasn't quite accurate because he did not have at least double of one of the requirements. Now, it didn't change the actual outcome of the gameplay, but rules are important, and I apologize for any confusion that that might have caused. Hopefully, this cleared it up. But until the next episode, thanks for watching.